turned 35 January 10th, 1942. Let's see what kind of damage Lodrick does to us. More troops coming in, huh? Ah, uh, regiment. This will spell the end. Of course. No sooner than I send some ships out, they run right into a sub. What kind of bullshit? I decided not to shoot. Mini KB must be there. It might have must have Mini KB down protecting those landings at said Fiji Islands. bombers here. He's long range captain. That was the morning phase.
Yeah, mini KB. At least one carrier. That's a sunk AMC. Ho show, huh? Come on. Alright, that's the PM phase. Why is, what's he doing? I don't understand why he's only bombarding here and he could take the base. Here we go. Big attack in Singapore. if he has enough force to take it or not. Since last time he crossed, he didn't do it on the shock attack. And he lost a lot more troops than uh, I did. Alright. Let's pop it and see what happens. Uh, we lost one. Another division of his is disabled. But we lost a unit. Alright. A barman at Kukong. Not accomplishing a whole lot here. He must have high disruption. Okay, that regiment should not be involved in the attack. Still has about 10 to 1 odds. Yep. He'll take Tarawa, no problem. I'll take Gazmata. Interesting. Come on, guys, hold.
Oh, we're attacking. I did not realize we were attacking. I thought... Hmm. Did I, not? I must not have told him not to. Damn it. Alrighty. Well. Building some, doing some pr uh, production. Once it's done, we'll save the game. Um, we'll grab some intel, come back and do the after action. Alrighty, another turn we get beat up on, as usual, but that's to be expected. It's only January. Alright, some stats here. Score-wise, Japan went up 252 points. We dropped two. We're still barely winning in the point fight, but that'll soon change. Um, looks like we lost no planes. He lost three to Ops. Let's take a look at those. He lost a Sally, a Babs, and a Jake. Alrighty. We're expecting two groups of uh, P-40s next turn, both at Brisbane. Then starting after that, we start getting some hurricanes up in Aiden. We'll have to move, we'll have to ship out. Ship sunk. We did lose a ship last turn, and AMC is sitting at uh, Suva. It's kind of one of those things where, you know, we had, we had to run or we lose it in, in port, so... Not a big deal there. Incoming ships for us. One day we get a bunch of AKs. Four days we get a battleship, heavy cruiser, some destroyers, along with a handful of subs, and a bunch of freaking AKs. Wow. And then six days we get the Indomitable and a sub. And then 11 days, we get two battleships and a destroyer on the west coast. And then a couple days later, we get some subs. And, yep, we have ships are starting to, to come in. On the ground, we got three days to get an Australian brigade up in uh, Aden. In four days, we get a lot of units. Mostly, looks like base for forces, AV, engineers, that sort of thing. And one, another Australian brigade. So that'll be, that'll be nice to have. I don't think we have anything coming up for withdraw. Nope, those are that's a convoy. That's that's one guy. He's in San Fran. That's fine. Okay, those guys are good. All right, let's pull up combat reporter and we'll take a look at this at the signet report. See if we can glean anything from that. Nope, a little low this turn. Rainbow, Mary, Higato, Shanghai, Rabal. 184. Not sure where. 183, 184. That's like below Oz, isn't it? Okay, that's between Oz and Tasmania. Okay. And units determined where they're located. Let's see, anything out of the ordinary? I wonder why that guy's at, at Clark. Nothing super useful. All right. Go ahead and pop that out. Pop back to the map. Let's go up to Burma and India. Not a whole lot going on. Just move some ships around. And Burma, it looks like. Did any more of his troops arrive? One, one more unit of troops of his arrived and prone, but the rest are not still not there. We got a few of our units out. We are all running up the, to the coast. Down in Malaya, we bombarded here. This was about, about 10 AV worth of points. Bad thing is, it says we have all. Oh, that says we don't have any artillery. That's why we showed no AV. So okay, so we will attack here. We might take this base. A little bit of luck. 
It'd be nice. We'll maybe kill some aircraft, any whatever ships are showing in here, and push these three units out. At Singapore, we held off again. Alright, we're doing good though. Look, almost no disruption, very low fatigue. Eventually, we will. I mean, we are losing the assault value every time he assaults, but we lost like a thousand, he lost like three thousand. So, I'm not sure what these guys are doing here. They're not, they haven't landed yet. I'm guessing he's getting ready to come in and start clearing the mines as soon as he takes the base. Nothing going on in Sumatra, nothing going on in Java. Not, not much new going on in Borneo. He landed at Tanjo Ingsilor to kill my units here. I don't know if they'll run away or not. They may run into the jungles. They may just surrender. Over in, in Luzon, so it's holding at, at, at uh, Bataan. He's, he's waiting for this other unit party to arrive before he attacks me here. And nothing at Mindanao. He, he did take, take Tawi Tawi. And this is a sub here. I need to keep him moving. Nothing farther south of there has been really approached at all. We got ships moving around the northwest corner. They're going to come down to Perth. A bunch of them will just refuel and then head off map. We got ships coming around the southwest corner. Basically the same thing. A radio report like in here. Interesting. Could he be patrolling KB down here trying to catch me? Huh. I don't know. But Lady Lex is away. She's heading back to Pearl. We are we should be unloading some of this here. Alright. So we can load, we can refuel Saratoga's ta task force. We got more fuel and supplies coming in. Um, Suva is all, but I mean it's isolated. These guys really have nowhere to go. I can't get them anywhere. Um, they will probably just I don't know. I'm gonna have, I don't think I can with I don't even think I can with I can't withdraw them. I check. Oh, I can't this guy. Why? Go ahead and withdraw him. Yes. Yeah, see, I can't withdraw these guys. Yeah, see, the planes are going to be destroyed. I don't have much choice. Because otherwise, he's going to come over and take the base and get points for him. Or he may, he may get points for those as well. I don't know for sure. But, let's see, not much else going on in the Eastern Pacific. Just moving men, supplies, mostly supplies and fuel to bases, then up in China. We have the typical shit show going on. Another unit arrived at Cyan. Oh, he's in good shape, 180 assault for He's a productive me member here. Get him into combat mode. Still trying to build some forts here. I don't know if we'll make it. He has not done anything at Kang. I'm not sure what his problem is or what his plan is here. He probably has the, the firepower to take it. But he's not. I mean, I have his supplies cut, cut off. Multiple. I'm cutting off a lot of supplies here. We attacked again here by accident. All right, one guy arrived. And this guy, is he arriving this turn? Yep. Oh, they'll both arrive. Okay, cool. Next turn, we'll have another. We'll have another seven hundred assault value here. We'll have a thousand of fresh thousand assault value of fresh troops. To hit this, hit these guys with. Looks like they're trying to run. But um, if he wasn't move mode, he's not now. Actually, we could check if he was in move mode or not. 
Come down here to our attack. Nope, he was not in move mode, so he's in combat mode, so he's moving slow. All right. But that's the turn. He has a unit here. We have not a whole lot to protect with. Which way did he come? And his supplies are cut off. This is not a very big unit. It's a base force unit, but it still does the trick. He has nowhere to go. I mean, he cannot. He can move out, but he cannot retreat out of there. So if he attacks and gets mauled, he's in trouble. Let's see. Yep, definitely trying to retreat there. Yep, he has. He caught up with us. Of course he did, because you know we're moving slower. Because you know somehow we always always are. But. All right, not much else to go over here. If you enjoy watching the turn, please go ahead and click on the like button. If you're following along in campaign or my one against Helson and you have not clicked the subscribe button, please go ahead and click it. it gives us better stats, which brings in more viewers, gets more exposure to the game. You know the drill. Until the next turn, you guys have yourself a great day, and we'll see you later.